Go to the customize it. You'll just pull it up. So this particular title is a chess game, but we're really focused on making sure there's a high fidelity graphics. You have real-time reflections, real-time shadowing. Um, there's a campaign mode where you have 40 different components, interactive tutorials, puzzles, like stuff that kind of is really meant for you to have harder and harder point opponents with more and more advanced tutorials to get people better at chess. Um, and then there's a very um, inclusive multiplayer mode. We have a casual chat room where you can just have 10 people in a room, you can view anybody else's game, challenge people to games, it's all unrated. And then there's a speed only mode where you literally are just thrown into matches, speed chess over and over again, uh, two minute, five minute matches. And then there's also a tournament mode where you'll be thrown into tournaments, kind of like poker, where you'll have uh, you'll get set up with round robin and single elimination tournaments and multiplayer, and it's all just set up for you to go into it. Can I resume a match when I have a match with a friend and then uh, someone has dropped out or the connection is lost or something? Can I resume this match? Well, as long as they stay on. So, I mean, since there's it's, it's the, the duplication of having two people in a game allows it, so as long as one person is there, then you have a good 90 seconds to try and reconnect and get back in. We are setting it up so that if you get a phone call, something like that, the game will still be in the background running and you can just resume and it should be fine. If it kills the app though, you're going to have to jump back in and hope that it hasn't been 90 seconds. There's not much we can all, we can do because the other guy can't just be sitting there waiting all the time. Um, but then yeah, with single player,